the availability and sales of autonomous cars have been increasing over the past decade, a select few US rideshare companies are pioneering the industry by introducing the technology to their users. Robo taxis look just like average cars, like the ones passing behind me, but they're hands free. Autonomous or self driving cars have been around for a while, but they're increasing in popularity. And now this service offered in Las Vegas offers a new rideshare option on the market. It's picking up the car in front of us here. A driverless tech company and a transit software company teamed up to launch free self driving rides in downtown Las Vegas. So here's the Via app. And the first step is to download the app. Then you input your pickup and your drop-off location and book a ride. And then once you get into the vehicle, you can use the app to scan a QR code in the in-vehicle screen and away you go. The car itself has driverless features, but Motional, the company that provides the robo-taxis, has two people in the car at all times. Right now, we're in uh, manual, as you can see here. But once we turn out and make this ride, when James feels it's safe, he'll push a button on the uh, steering wheel, and then the car will go into auto. Hands-free features like detecting stoplights. And they can tell when the light's about to turn red, yellow, or green. And detecting other cars or people. And we have pedestrians right here jaywalking. They're always alert, they're never texting, they're never under the influence. They see so much further ahead than what myself, if I was driving the car, might be able to see. Casey Caldwell from Car and Driver magazine says the trend of self-driving cars has a long way to go before they're fully autonomous. It's just going to be a really slow roll for this technology um, before it's really in people's hands and being used um, the way everyone wants it to be used. Still, Motional plans to launch a robo-taxi without their drivers in the car next year. For now, the robo-taxis are only offered here in Sin City, but the two companies hope to expand to other cities in the future. And the robo-taxis are also offered on the Las Vegas Strip, but through a different rideshare app.